Hi hey guys, today I wanted to talk about one of my favourite villains in the Marvel Universe, The Hand. Now, The Hand, although many might think they're quite campy villains, being ninjas and all, red ninjas, I mean that's about the campest thing you can be, I think they're probably the most chronically underused villain in the Marvel Universe. I mean, they're perfect for cannon fodder, aren't they? I mean, you can just show up, chuck a bunch of them, any superhero you want, and it's just a great sequence of battle scenes you have. I mean, you could have... I mean, think about the number of villains the Hand have tussled with in their history anyway. You know, they tussled with Wolverine, most prominently. The X-Men as a group. Daredevil, again, Daredevil's probably the most prominent enemy of the Hand. I mean, they feature heavily in his comics anyway. The Daredevil, Elektra... God, even some of the Avengers, I think. Well, Captain America. Captain America fought the hand with Wolverine in uh, X-Men comics sometime in the 80s. That was pretty cool. So I think there's a great opportunity for the hand to be featured more often. I mean, they did just do an awesome storyline featuring Daredevil and the hand, which I'll be reviewing in a couple of weeks when I finish reading it, because I've just bought it. And... You know, that was awesome. So I think they really, really, really sh should be using the hand more often. I mean, maybe it's just me. I like ninjas. <laughs> I'm a big fan of ninjas. But to me, they just seem like... I mean, obviously, the reason to include the hand has to be a bit convoluted. I mean, because of what they are, a mystical clan of ninjas, very, very focused on their objectives, you'd have to have a rather convoluted way to mix them with other superheroes they don't normally tangle, tangle with. But I reckon it should definitely be done more often. I mean, there really aren't that many villains in the Marvel Universe, even singular villains like Magneto, that, that are used quite so effectively. I mean, Magneto is overused. That's certainly true. Magneto is certainly overused. But even though he's overused, it still, still takes quite a bit of time to get his storylines going. And so it ends up being a rather very convoluted way of spinning, you know, a plot into, you know, ten issues rather than just, you know, one or two. Whereas if you had the hand, they could be around for one, two issues, have the fight scenes and then just they just crumble into dust. And it's a really good way of mixing things up a bit. So I think the hand should definitely be featured far more often in Marvel Comics. But that's just, but again, I'll say it for the third time. For me, that's just my opinion. I'm a massive fan of ninjas. Tell me what you think. Okay, that's it from me. I'll be back again tomorrow. See you. Bye.